Good. We haven't missed the sorting ceremony. I'm no expert, but that seems more appropriate. Now, I need to study this locket as soon as I can, but first I must contact the Ministry. They need to know what happened to George and be warned of Ranrock. For the moment, I ask that you keep all that's happened this evening between you and me. Of course, sir. Thank you. Ready for the sorting ceremony? Phineas, Nigellus, Black. Prepare yourself to meet the Headmaster. Fig, nice of you to join us. The sorting ceremony is over. There were complications. Complications? It seems the goblin Enough. problem has... Goblins. I've no time for rumors, Fig, and I'm rapidly losing whatever patience I had left. If you're lucky, we might still be able to get you sorted this evening. <clears throat> I'll be in touch. Professor Weasley, we've one more to be sorted. Welcome. You're just in time. Have a seat. Ah, yes. A bit older than the others, aren't you? You come here with preferences and preconceptions. Certain expectations. And with that, welcome to another episode of Hogwarts Legacy. Calder here again. Just headed right into it. The sorting ceremony. So let's see what house will join. Uh, you come here with preferences and preconceptions. Certain expectations. Can't wait to start class. I'm looking forward to exploring Hogwarts and the world beyond the castle and grounds. Mm. <coughs> Indeed. Much can be gleaned by having an adventurous spirit. But your professors have a great deal to teach you as well. Hmm, interesting. You've recently learned that you possess a rare ability. I detect a growing sense of ambition. An eagerness for power. Perhaps you belong in Slytherin. No, I don't. Cunning ambition and hunger for power. Nope, not going to happen. Ravenclaw. Hufflepuff, Gryffindor, Slytherin, Ravenclaw, of course. And you've a ready mind. Quick to learn. You belong in Ravenclaw! And one more thing. Due to the unfortunate injury on the pitch in last spring's final, this year's Quidditch season has been cancelled. What? Enough! It's not as though I've banned flying altogether. But don't tempt me. You are here to focus on your academic futures. 
I'm sure you all have plenty to do before classes begin tomorrow. I said, I'm sure you all have plenty to do before classes begin tomorrow. Quite an entrance. It's lovely to meet you. I'm... Professor Weasley, would you be so kind as to show our new student to their common room? I shall see to it, sir. As I was saying, I'm Professor Weasley. Pleased to meet you. Nice to meet you as well, Professor. As Deputy Headmistress, it is my distinct honor to show you to your common room. Right this way. Right, show me. It's quite uncommon for a student to begin as a fifth year. Might be a bit of a challenge, but one I'm sure you're up for. I am, Professor. This is the entrance to the Ravenclaw common room. You must solve a riddle to enter. I won't be of much help, I'm afraid. This sort of thing has always confounded me. Who lived longer? The ghost? Or the poltergeist? A ghost or a poltergeist? Hmm. A non-being can never have been. done now go on in and get some sleep you have a big day ahead of you tomorrow i shall be back in the morning to collect you for your first class thank you professor weasley you're welcome i hope you enjoy your first night at hogwarts sleep well oh just <laughs> Looks like everyone's gone. Better head to the common room. Let's have a look around first before we go anywhere. It's my bed. Some pictures. Chair. Oh. So nothing of interest right now. Good. Let's go up in. It's up there. All right. Okay. Can't go through there. This should be interesting. All right. And here's my cover. Introductions are in order. Oh, no, no introductions. Ever clock? Nope. You're not the first I'm going to meet. Deep breath. Emit the car. And <laughs> no names. Alright. I'm not sure this is the right spot. Yep, yeah, she looks good. I want him to be in the perfect place. A place he'll be happy with. But I can't seem to find it. Great golden gobstones! I want him to thrive here. Golden gobstones? <laughs> My own little expression. I bought this Dittany seedling from home, and I so want him to feel cozy. Dittany is amazing, isn't it? So much healing power in such a little plant. <laughs> I've a bit of a thing for plants, as you can see. <laughs> Pleased to meet you. I'm Samantha. Nice to meet you, Samantha. Is Dittany used in Wiganwell potion? It is. Looks like someone's been studying up on their potion making. Actually, Professor Fig told me about the Wigan World Potion. Of course. I heard you were studying with him before term. He's an enigma, Fig. Teaches about theory. It seems to know a lot about practical magic. Professor Fig does know a great deal about, um, different forms of magic. Well, I hope he told you about more than Wigan Weld. You've lots to catch up on, I'm sure. Right. <laughs> yeah, let's ask that. Is it common practice for students to grow their own ingredients? Oh, yes. In fact, 
Our herbology teacher, Professor Garlic, encourages it. <laughs> Professor Garlic, I really? I think Professor Sharp, our potions master, cares where you get your ingredients, as long as your brews are all perfect. Alright. An affinity for herbology is more typical of a Hufflepuff than a Ravenclaw, isn't it? Ordinarily, perhaps. But it runs in my family. We've a full plot of these little fellows back home. I suppose you could say herbology is in my roots. Mm, okay. It was nice to meet you, Samantha. Good luck with your Disney. Thank you. And good luck to you too on your first day. One thing I haven't introduced yet. Okay, I need to introduce to Emmett and Everett as well. That's just brilliant, Ami. Brilliant. Brilliant. You think you could... Ah! That is not how that... Why, hello. Would you like to take a look? Sure. Can't see too much in the day. Well, except for stars like Sirius, Canopus, Vega, and Arcturus. I'm Amit. Pleasure to have you in Ravenclaw. Never met someone who's been so close to a dragon before. Can't say I'd recommend it, frankly. It's nice to meet you, Amit. I take it you like astronomy. Oh, yes. So much to be learned from the stars. Also, there's something about the open air and night sky above the tower. It's invigorating. You will adore astronomy. Professor Shaw is incredibly knowledgeable. <laughs> just like the lightning. Lighting is just perfect around my face. <laughs> Not my body. <clears throat> mm, are they fascinating? I don't think so. I'm afraid I'm not much for memorizing constellations. Enough to worry about on the ground. Well, you should know that all fifth years must take astronomy. However, I think you will feel differently after one night up on the tower. A quality telescope can show you things you never dreamed of. I suppose I'll see you in class then. Yes. Oh, and speaking of class, better get to my first one of the year. Nothing like the smell of fresh parchment, is there? Be seeing you. Oh, thanks. Okay, so there's some tower for astrology. Sure, I'll check it out. <laughs> and let's meet with Everett. <laughs> so fucking weird. One moment. Watch this. Ugh. What is this? I just come on through a dumb box. <laughs> let's get out of here. That wasn't quite the reaction I wanted. Oh well. Right. What did you hope would happen? I suppose I hoped it would lighten the mood. Ravenclaws can be a bit on edge the first day of class. I'm Everett, by the way. You seem downright calm next to some of these characters. And you survived a rather harrowing trip here. I'm glad to be here. Ready for classes to start. Good. Glad to hear it. Truly, there's no reason to be nervous. Most professors are firm, but fair. I mean, not all of the tricks I play are as simple as a tossed dung bomb, and I'm still here. Wait, did you say most professors are firm, but fair? Ha, <laughs> I did. But probably best I let you judge for yourself. I do tend to push their limits. I should wander off before someone traces that dung bomb back to me. <laughs> nice meeting you. You too, Everett. It's not that hard hey to there. trace back. New Ravenclaw. Professor Weasley is looking for you just outside. You had best not keep her waiting. Awesome. Here's the Dow outside. Beautiful statue. Should be Rowena Ravenclaw, I think. Really fucking nice. The stars on the floor. Hello. Okay, do with F. Why is it flickering? Oh, I can spin it. Nice. <laughs> Some books. She's down there. Another telescope. Huh. Could ignite it, but I don't have the spell for it. And around here, just the raven. For sure. Alright then. Thanks for this episode, and we'll see you in the next.